You've mastered the art of PvP by now, haven't you? If not, I recommend watching my PvP guide before this, but either way, you're about to see 5 of this week's best looking and most importantly, best practical outfits for your character to use in PvP. Also, check my Instagram in the description below if you want to send over any outfits or anything content related. If you want me to feature it, I'll give you a little shout out in the top left of your Instagram or your YouTube channel, so it's just a way for you to get involved with the videos. Let's get into it! The Banana Bandit. This yellow mayhem machine is your best way of showing confidence through the scary yellow stitches, wire mask covered in barbed wire and back straps, similar to the legend Bane from Batman. Of course, you've probably noticed this outfit does not feature a helmet, which means you'll be a one shot kill against a headshot, so you can definitely equip the helmet and mask glitch to have that armoured protection. But I personally use this outfit when playing against average players that don't really pose no real threat as looking badass is more important when they don't even aim at your head. It looks amazing with any yellow weapon camo, especially the shotgun so you can hunt your enemies at night and give them the fright of getting killed by a minion that was a sick rhyme by accident. I love the black and lime straps vest as well, it features like a spray painted yellow writing that gives like a savage soldier gone rogue type of look so you can feel like the ruthless mercenary you are. As well as black driving gloves to give the outfit a more completed look and black combat pants because they're one of the nicest military bottoms on the market. Enjoy being the banana bandit. The Business Hitman Do you have to make money as the lobby's most powerful CEO but can't seem to get away from the dirty tryhards constantly shooting shots your way? Then you've came to the right place. The best of both worlds. Be the business hitman everyone aspires to be by using the Portola suit available from the sharp heist outfits. Complete with the famous red hitman tie so players know you mean business. Asian 47 type stuff. Not to forget the white stitch wire mask which is the alternative to the yellow one we had previously on the banana bandit with white surgical gloves so you never have to worry about leaving your fingerprints at the crime scene or getting them dirty when accessing the prison wallet. The business hitman comes with black body armor you can add for free from the inventory menu for added protection although can be worn without it if you so please. The helmet called black quad lens has built in night vision which you can easily turn on and off for various pvp situations and it takes free bullets until death. Like go make that blood money in style. Operation Cat Tag Originally I was going to call this outfit Snow Cat due to the constant theme of white but I thought it sounded too soft so a mention of the fact this cat is wearing its own name tags. I feel this is the outfit to change the stigma all tags are dog tags. Cats can be soldiers too you know. What else do I need to say when so much beauty is presented in your face? Since you're still here I'll give more detail. The geo grey and white cat mask is what is going to turn you into the cat you've always wanted to be with this Vietnam style helmet called the medic combat helmet that will surprisingly take free bullets before you die with the words born to save written on the side of it because of course your only purpose wearing this outfit will be to save your ego by destroying anyone that comes in a 75 mile proximity of you at any time. The Rolex on the left wrist so you can write down the exact time you killed a griefer and not to mention you'll want this outfit during the times of snow as the white will allow you to blend in a lot easier than darker colours especially the tan combat pants but like I said you're a cat commando wearing dog tags what's not to like? Los Santos Special Forces. If you're walking, or these days should I say flying the oppressor broomstick around the city looking like this, you better make sure you're an above average PvP player because this just screams Special Forces. With the black mono ballistic mask completely covering your head in a modern military helmet that has big dark blue eyes that will give your enemies nightmares and your side girls even better dreams. The helmet is once again the black quad lens which takes free bullets before death and comes with night vision as operating on a level of the special forces you'll most likely live your whole life in night vision. Yes that includes sunbathing by the ocean with your RPG and the beautiful tan on your nice armor. The outfit has black heist pants in the utility pants section 
option to give a more buff look to your character's legs without ever needing to hit the gym. That's like every man's dream. Also, with the light strike fast, which I don't see anyone really use, but it's honestly it's such a nice looking vest and it just has to look like an absolute machine. Of course, none of these vests add any protection, it's just cosmetic, so you'll still need to manually add body armor through the interaction menu. Under the vest is the black battle vest utility top, and then the black tactical gloves to keep your fingers all warm and cozy while you completely genocide an entire lobby. I almost forgot to mention as well, with this vest, you can actually equip your crew logo on the back, so you can represent any crew while you're putting in serious work. Absolute beautiful advantage of this outfit that not many others get to have with the other body armors. Come the machine you've always wanted to be. Valhalla's Vengeance. Come on, you have to admit, that's a badass name for an outfit. I, I just I just thought of that like three seconds in and I'm damn proud of it, right? This is my personal favorite PvP outfit that I use in 90% of my fights. And those of you that watch the PvP guide will for sure recognize this work of art. In fact, I read a few comments asking how to get this mask. I'm just, I'm just gaslighting myself at this point, aren't I? Self-love is important, boys, all right? The mask is a clean horn skull mask, which gives us sick horns and how we looking like a possible cult leader with the black combat helmet. But this time with the text born to die as when you're wearing something as fierce looking as this on the scale of a viking you're definitely fighting to die in honor to get into valhalla helmet also takes free bullets until death and comes with a packet of emergency smokes the outfit has the personal choice of a chain but i choose the big dicks one as it replicates the mass of shlong the viking has when killing their enemies it has the black combat pants from the team pants section with black driving gloves which together make it harder for players to spot you as you will blend in with most buildings especially at night i think it looks better with no t-shirt on as it gives the reckless warrior feeling but you can add anything to these outfits to make it more personal to you to valhalla brother you're another level ahead of the rest of los santos with these outfits like subscribe hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the finest gta content thanks for watching spartans